All right, this fucking shit didn't work last uh, to distribution, but uh, this one it does work, and I want to make it so I can remember it. Now uh, this is to connect your Wiimote to your computer on uh, Ubuntu here, uh, Jaunty. So what we need is um, these three packages in your uh, uh, Synaptic. Uh, WM input, uh, the GUI version, and uh, LSWM. So that's what we need. Now uh, to test uh, if your uh, Wiimote is working or transmitting a uh, signal with your Bluetooth. So you need to have a Bluetooth on you need to have a Wiimote, okay, and you need to be running Ubuntu because that's what I'm on. Um, what we do in here is uh, type in LSWM, and this will try to find the signal um, to your Wiimote. So right now you have to push one two on your Wiimote. So you keep pushing one two. Now if it doesn't work, you just run the command again until you find the fucking uh, uh, ID for the remote then there we go we have our ID there right now this ID is different for everyone okay because the Wiimote has different IDs for each of them so this is our ID here right and we're probably gonna use this later so uh, save that uh, for later so we know that it is working and uh, we can test it out in um, let me see. In the GUI also um, up here, we go to accessories and go down to um, GW uh, WM GUI, right? The Wiimote GUI here, and we can connect in here also. So we're just gonna go to File, Connect, and we press OK, and then keep pushing one and two on your Wiimote so don't let the lights go out just keep pushing it unable to connect we just keep connecting do it again motherfucker connect and it should connect any minute now there we go it's connected so just keep trying till you connect it um, and we can see that it is connected because if you look here, if I push the button, it will be green. See, uh, A, B, all that. You know. There we go. We have it right. And in here, we can do some uh, testing also, like in the settings here. Uh, you have uh, the acceleration. So if I swing my uh, Wii mote, you can see that the X, Y, and Z coordinates, it's uh, responding. Uh, they have some uh, infrared data, but uh, I, I doubt we can do anything right now. So yeah, there's nothing. And the extension data, uh, I don't have the nunchuck connected, so we can't do that either. Uh, as for the controls here, the LED one two three four is the the four little LEDs on your Wiimote, the bottom of the controller. If you select one of these, the light switch goes on. Okay. So you see a blue light if you check it on the right spot too. Uh, same thing with the rumble. If you want it to rumble, you can hear a noise. See that? You can hear that. I'm gonna turn that shit off now. So these are some of the testing that you can do on uh, the Wii Remote GUI here, and uh, that should be done with. So we're gonna quit that. All right. Now, if we want to um, make our uh, Wiimote um, work as a um, keyboard, a mouse, a joystick. What we gotta do is um, uh, en enter this command in there. Let me see. What the hell? Uh, GK sudo gedit and slash etc slash modules. Now this will add it to the kernel on boot up. So uh, it will load it. And what you gotta do in here is uh, basically add in uh, on this one at the end, U input, right? Just type that in and uh, save it, save it, right? And that's pretty much it. Um, 
you either have to restart your computer right now that is the best the best option or you can you know type in um, let me see what was that sudo mod pro u input and this just started right now and you can start using your remote as a uh, keyboard um, you know or um, um, a mouse or a joystick whatever the hell it is uh, for the certain program so that is uh, the end of this one uh, part one